I'll be your eyes. I know you can spare me. Go if you want. But when she tries to kill you, be prepared to strike first. All right. I'm Jal Amaderov. I'll be your envoy through Angaran space. It's gonna be cozy, so I hope you like people. I hope I don't regret this. Me too. I'm pretty sure you're regretting it already. Just saying. I've organized my analysis of Aya. Shall I relay it to the Nexus? Definitely. I mean, I had to do a scan. No, I will. You really think the Moshe is alive? I'm sure of it. Don't Maybe kill yourself bigger. bringing her home. No promises. Can I I'm here to... I am Enro Bosan, assistant to Governor Paranshai. You're free to explore this area, but the city is off limits. Until that changes, I'll be your liaison. How may I help you, Pathfinder? You sounded like you and Jal know each other. Our families are related. You sound nothing alike. We have multiple worlds. Our culture is complex. I'd like to know more. Earn our trust and maybe you will. What can you tell me about your other worlds? Life on them is hard. The people harder. Every day is a struggle to survive. Why not bring everyone here? We will not abandon any more worlds to the Ket. And Aya cannot support all of us. When am I allowed to visit the city again? That's not for me to decide. Who will? Your boss? Or Ephra? Governor Shai has jurisdiction over Aya. She will authorize your entrance if you earn Ephra's trust. A museum curator and a colony supplier asked to meet you. They're waiting nearby. The Ket swayed us with words. Now we judge outsiders by their actions. You don't just stand here waiting to answer my questions, right? I assist the governor in all matters. While you're here, this is my priority. Pretty far outside your normal job, huh? I did not begin this day expecting to speak with it. You? <laughs> nice save. With an alien. Yeah, it's been a long day. Thanks for your time, Enro. Of course. Stars above. It's you. I was hoping to get a chance to speak with you. You left your home to cross dark space. Is it true that you can never go back? Seem to have yeah. This is home now. To take such a risk and give up your old life. Why did you do it? I couldn't resist the adventure of a lifetime. I know the feeling. There's a rush in taking a chance and hoping for the best. My turn for a question. Do I get to know your name? Oh, of course. I'm Avela Kajawa. Curator for the Repository of History. We study relics of our past, try to piece together what we lost in the Scourge. And, the truth is, there was something I wanted to talk to you about. Pathfinder, how much do you know about our history? The Cat hit your people pretty hard, right? They did, but long before that, the Scourge destroyed our technology, first targeting our ships. Many of those ships went down over Havaral, the wilds of that planet are filled with history. A scientist on Havaral just contacted me with a new nav point of an intact crash site. A huge opportunity. But with Remnant patrolling the area, we can't get close enough. Not like you can. How do you know about me and the Remnant? I have friends in the Resistance. They heard your conversation with Ephra. I know it's a lot to ask, but you have a ship and the means to get past the Remnant. Without your help, I'm stuck. I don't think Ephra would be too happy with this arrangement. Ephra doesn't have to know, and if he finds out, he can direct his anger at me. Takes guts to stand up to him. I'd face worse to get a piece of our history back. You're trusting your history with an outsider? I know what people say about you, but I don't agree. I think you're here to help. 
I, I am. just got here. Now's your chance to prove it. You want to earn Aya's respect, right? Recovering our past will go a long way. I've always wanted here. to give archaeology a try. Say much about oh, I was hoping you'd say that. If you find anything, I'll be here. Thank you, Pathfinder. Trade? Trade. Trade. Are you asking or telling? I'm wondering. Do you exchange goods and services? How does your economy work? We pay for things with a currency called credits. Abstract wealth. The cat offered gifts. Made odd bargains. Never traded. What are your credits worth? What can we do with them? You pay them to us for whatever we're selling. Now we cut open the heart. And what do you offer? I can set up a meeting to arrange a formal trade agreement. Complicated. Another time. Is there something else I can do for you? Yes. Call me Soka. I run cargo between Aya and other worlds. Good work. Good at it. You're here to help my people. Prove it. I need help. One of my suppliers off-world stopped checking in. Has things I need. There could be trouble. What makes you think I can help? You found Aya, maybe you find my supplier. Can't hurt to ask. We might have different definitions of trouble. What do you mean? Natural hazards, wild predators, misadventure, what do you mean? Same thing. What's your supplier carrying, exactly? Supplies I need, exactly. Things to keep my people alive. Essentials. You have a ship? I have my supplier's nav point. His name is Kelvo. Find him, his supplies. Come back and prove you're helpful. Then maybe we trade. Okay, that was interesting. I feel like he was saying it like that so I would understand. Because he wasn't sure if I understood. Uh, the Ket have felt the power of the resistance and they know their end is coming. Our victories on Volod are only the beginning of what can be achieved, but we can't defeat the enemy without your help. Uh, if you're tired of living in fear, if you believe we were meant for something greater than slavery, if you're willing to stand up and fight, you will find a new family in the resistance. We'll train you, strike back at the cat, and reclaim our what is ours. Alright. Let's bounce and go see, go save the damn galaxy. Rider, ship's fixed up and ready to fly. Your ship is... <laughs> we have nothing like it. Wait till you see the inside. <laughs> it gets better? Oh yeah. You ready to go? Yeah, I'm gonna be talking to you, Space Poncho. I'll introduce you to the rest of my crew. part it looks like a galactic retirement home okay 
I'm just contract. saying, as far as first contact goes, at least that went better than the last one. For humans. <laughs> Only slightly. Yeah, what happened? I wanted to look around. And now we have another mouth to feed, whatever he eats. Did the translators not work? They work. I know we're improvising as we go, but let's remember that there is Pathfinder team protocol. Don't think I got that handbook. Ryder, we followed our best lead here, and now we don't even have that. Jal has offered to do what he can to help us access the vault on Aya. How do we do that when we're leaving the planet it's on? That's... a fair point. <laughs> Jal? Seriously? Settle down. Ryder's right. There's an Angara right here. Let's hear from the new guy. Come on. Don't hide back there. One day, about 80 years ago, the Archon and the Ket arrived in Helios, and the horror began. They declared war? Nothing so easy to define or fight. The Ket kidnap Angara. Their people disappear without a trace. What if they were us? Sure, I'll fight Ket all day long, but that's no plan. I agree. We need to get into that vault, Ryder. Surprisingly, I'm with PB. Our own mission has to take priority. We have a plan. Kind of. Pretty solid. Jal? The resistance is stretched thin. I was tasked with traveling to two of our worlds at our briefing this morning. And you'll accompany me. Because? Because then, Ephra will see you as trustworthy. You want that. Jal's told me about these two worlds, Havarl and Vold. Ooh, pretty. Before the Scourge disaster, Vold was a thriving planet of billions. A shining center of technology and life. And now? It's the center of our ground war against the Ket. Our resistance base is fighting Ket Command for control of the planet. What about the other? Aval is the birthplace of the Angara. It's started to degrade, to become wild and dangerous. We suspect Remnant. Now we're talking. We've recently lost contact with our scientists. Still don't get how any of this helps us. I do. Help us, or rather help me, and I'll vouch for you, right? Because Jal wants inside Aya's vault, too. Pathfinder, it's your call. <sighs> Look, we could use the help. I mean, we're fight they know more about fighting the Ket than we do. Because they've been doing it a lot longer than us at a minimum of 80 years so we kind of need them to help us fight Ket also the more that are fighting the Ket that we don't have to worry about fighting afterwards is normally a good thing the enemy of my enemy is my friend or some philosophical bullshit like that but having this problem like uh... let me weigh the options I'll let you know We'll be ready, whatever you decide. Jal, give Kalo the nav points for both planets. Let's do this. Like, and we'll find more resources and maybe find more planets that we could actually live on. All right. Yes, it's a little out of our way to help people, but it's also... Still compiling my first impressions. Even their body language is so emotional. I can't wait for my first session with Jarl. Why not scare him away, huh? It's, it's probably going to be far more beneficial for us to actually help 